Boys, it's no shave November time, which you, you guys know what that means, right? No, um, no shaving November. Are you serious? Right, boys, today we're taking Messi's dream team and putting it up against CR7's dream team. Yo, I hate these episodes because I have to choose a favorite between Messi and Ronaldo, which, oh, can never make anyone happy, can it? Yo, check this out. A list of players that have played with Ronaldo. It literally goes up to 10 pages. And then we got the same with Lionel Messi as well. You guys can see, I mean, there's over 10 pages. These guys have been playing literally forever. Hey, right, we're going to be choosing 25 of the best players of all time, icons included to build their dream teams. You guys already know how this works right here. Icons, heroes, adds all the icons. Put all the heroes into the game. I need you guys right now to hit the biggest like on this video you guys have ever done. And today, I want you guys to do it with your chin, all right? Is it even possible? Um, yeah, no, it's definitely possible. So can we make this number go up? Like, yo, come on, boys. You know I say it all the time, man. If we had a million by the end of the year, I get the R9 Ronaldo haircut. Bro, we have so many subs left to go and only two months to do it. At this point, I'm starting to think it's going to be impossible. Yo, I can't believe you guys doubted me, but I actually did it for Halloween this year. Boom, we pulled off the legendary, the epic. You Mermaid. what? That's right. I actually did it. Tell me it's not good, bro. Like, look at the bra, man. Oh, look at that, man. <laughs> hey, yo, don't get any ideas, chat. All right. I, I see you. I see you guys down there in the comments. I'm taken. I'm taken to my partner. You guys can't have me. I'm with Barnacle Boy. People always ask, yo, B4, like, you have a girlfriend. Yeah, it's just Mermaid Man and Barnacle Boy. It's just how it is. On the real, if you guys do want to check out my Instagram, man, I'm always posting stuff that goes on in my real life world. So. Yo, check it out, man. Before Lancer 48 on Insta. All right, can we just get into building this dream team? I think it's time. Well, let's get this video kicked off. We are going to start by building Messi's dream team. Any person, any player who has played with Messi in his career qualifies. So we're just going to start with this full PSG team. What I am going to do is set a limit. Each team can only have, let's call it five icons. They can only have five icons slash hero cards. And yes, the rest just have to be players that they've played with before so another limit we're going to be setting is 20 players did i already say that if i haven't already ready ready set it 20 players max per team so you got to choose 20 of the best let's get this started man the free agents will have all of the icons okay we got to choose wisely only five and i want to say at least for Messi, there's way more than five the first has got to be this man right here xavi just makes the most sense I mean, he's played so many games with Messi. Overall, oh my God, I didn't realize it was that much. 399 total matches they played with each other. Yes, we are adding the PSG. We probably should do Barca, but um, it's just, it makes it so much easier for me to do PSG. It's where Messi's playing now. Xavi on PSG. Carlos Puyo. Oh yeah, I forgot we have two versions of the icons. I, I believe this is his middle version. Center back, 90 rated. Carlos Pollo, second player to join Messi as an icon. Oh yeah, boys, I'm using this right here. So I'm going to try to use players who have played a lot more matches with Messi because I could go to this 10th page. But like, yo, it's like these players have played three games with Messi, two games with Messi. Probably a lot of really good Legends icons who have only played like one or two or like less than 10, less than 20. Messi, Ronaldo. I'm going to try my best to avoid them. This man took on 80. Ooh, what is it? 80. 80 total matches. That's it. With Messi, Ronaldinho at Cam. So yes, he's on the team, and him and Messi are going to have to battle over who will play, like, because they're relatively the same position. I had three icons, and I can oh, I can only choose five. This is going to be really tough. Do I do Thierry Henry at left wing? He's 90 overall. Ooh, do I go with defenders? I feel like the attackers are just the ones that people are going to want to see. He won't even start, though. Thierry Henry is going to have to come off the bench, but I'm going to go for him. This is the last one I'm going to go for, man. We are going to go for the legend that is Samuel Eto. That leaves us, bro. We got one midfielder, one defender, three. No, we got two midfielders, two attackers, one defender. That's pretty even, to be honest. I like those choices of icons. So we have to get to removing some of these lower rated PSG. So PSG players, so we can get a total of 20 on the team. Even though Ramos, he's one that could qualify for both teams. But I'm actually removing him from PSG. Right? Because, like, he... Let's be honest. Everyone knows he deserves to be on the Ronaldo Dream Team. Okay, the remaining 15, you guys already know the drill. They have to be non-icons. We have so many attackers on this team, but this one needs to be done. Reuniting MSN. Actually, what we need to do is just go to Barca. Yo, hold up. Spain. Barcelona. Let's just go and grab a bunch of players. I feel like we need to do Ter Stegen. We should go for Valdez, but as an icon, nah, we can't do it. Aguero, no. 
I actually think I'm gonna do Busquets. We're gonna do Jordi Alba. We are gonna do PK. I don't wanna do like overloaded with Barca players, like current Barca players. I think we're gonna stick with that. Everyone on this first page is gonna stay on PSG. Suarez will stay. Di Maria will stay. I don't know about Verratti, Marquinhos. I don't even think like Hakimi. I mean, uh, yes, but he hasn't played that many matches. I guess since he's on PSG now, we might keep Hakimi. Next, I want to go for a few players that may not be super high rated, but they deserve to be playing on Messi's dream team. First will be an icon very, very soon. He's still in the game, bro. It hurts seeing him at 79 overall. Ah, it's going to go straight back up, though, as soon as he retires and he's in the game as an icon. But we're going to include Iniesta. It just makes sense. We'll go also for Rakitic. Only 82, but another midfielder who deserves a place in this team for the... God, what does my sheet say? 277 games he's played with Messi. So one more Barca player. I know, I mean, yes, not super high rated, but say here, Roberto has played so many games with Messi. It's, it's just deserved. And the final player, last but not least. We gotta do it, bro. Zlatan Ibrahimovic. He actually played a fair amount of games with the boy Messi. Well, only 42, but that's... That's still a pretty good amount. He will complete the team. I'm sure if you guys had the decision, you would have asked for me to use more icons. But I, I just didn't want the teams to be loaded with all icons. So I think I'm going to try to run the same formation with both teams. 4 2 3 attack. Or you know what would be more fun if we did with both teams? 4 2 4. Let's just make it fair. Use it with both teams. All out attack will make this video so sick. Let me know what you guys think of the team that we've built. Here's the thing that you guys need to know. Of course, there's going to be a lot of disagreements. I've I've just gone out and made a fun team. Let me know in the comments. Actually, just like be fair. Who would you guys have included? Like all of our teams would be different. That's the fun of these videos. So comment section for both teams. If you're a Messi or Ronaldo fan, show me the team you guys would have built. Right, boys. Up next, Manchester United. We got to do 24 to CR7 now. Here's the team. I mean, we already saw the first player that was added in. Sergio Ramos makes the cut. I'm so sorry, man. I'm so sorry, Phil Jones and freaking Jesse Lingard. You guys... Yeah, unfortunately, you guys are not making the cut. Right, into the free agents. Five icons for Ronaldo. Who are they going to be? The first one I want to go seek out. I want to find this man. We're doing it, bro. We're reuniting Wayne Rooney and CR7 to the same team. It's got to be done. The relationship, what a two great players, man. How could we not do Rooney? Let's actually go for an icon goalkeeper in Casillas just because they've played so many games. I'm trying to look over here. 288 games they've played alongside each other. So icon number two. Oh, and while we're here, um... Casemiro too. Yeah, let's just throw him in. Not an icon, but we're going to put him in the team. I want to try to take as many icon defenders as I can. So we will go. Oh, wait. Is he not in the game anymore? Am I dumb? Chat, chat am I dumb? No, he is in the game. Rio Ferdinand. All right, last two. Here we go. Let's go rapid fire here. We are going to go for gigs. For some reason, is on one of the Danish clubs already. We got gigs, and we are going to go for skulls as well. We've done a, honestly, we've done a phenomenal job with those icons. All right, dude, there's, there's so many players I'm going to go for. First off, we got to do Tony Cruz, like, have to. He's got to be in. In the game, not super high rated, but how could we not? I mean, he has played the third most games of anyone with Cristiano Ronaldo. Here's number one. This is the man who's played the most games with Cristiano. It is Kareem, the freaking dream, who's still killing it right now in real life. Another one, not super high rated, but it's got to be done, bro. Freaking Marcello. Marcelo. So up next, Luca Modric. Try that one more. Luca. 87 overall, bro. When it used to be Ronaldo, and then he had Modric and Cruz running the midfield. Dude, freaking good times. All right, what are we looking like here? Who's getting released next? Telus, yeah, probably not going to make it. Wambasaka, yeah, probably not going to make it. We're only going for one goalkeeper, so De Gea getting cut. Maguire. Shaw, Cavani, we got to keep Varane, Rashford, Pogba, Sancho, new players, but I still might keep them. Oh, you know what? I've just realized I've mixed up a player. So this guy is on PSG. I think ah, I kept him on PSG when he should, he shouldn't be on PSG. Yes, he's played with both, but let's be honest. Di Maria should be with Ronaldo, not Messi, which means I got to give Messi one more player. And I am, God, dude. FIFA. Let me search his freaking name, bro. We're going to go for Dembele. Right. The last player we're going for. We're CR7. Boys, I wish he was still as good as he once was. Gareth Bale. Oh, man. This guy was my favorite player for so long. And I mean, hey, got older and it is what it is. But Bale at one point, bro. At one point, top 
top five top five in the world easy i think about to be an insane matchup i'm i'm pumped for this one let's go for it four two four now that i look at it this team do the four oh this formation just it doesn't work for this team you know what man i said i was gonna do it but this team just it doesn't work they got freaking rooney like this doesn't even work i want to play both rooney and ben you know what i'm gonna do uh, this is about to be whack i'm doing three at the back three at the back is is Messi's team gonna be two op now that it's three in the back versus four at the front what um, am, I, am I just screwing this whole video up, man? No, I think it's... I actually think this is going to be fine, man. I think we got two formations that suit both teams really, really well. Let's go. You guys saw how this works. Leg one is the kickoff mode. What do we got here, man? It's looking like it actually does favor CR7 with Manchester United leading an attack and defense. PSG, Messi's dream team getting the lead in the midfield. I'm not ready to make my prediction. I'm not ready to just choose between Messi or Ronaldo and just see my comment section go insane. Right, boys, let's go. Oh, what do I do, bro? Who do I go for? Oh, my God. I actually don't know. I actually, can I pick no one? Can I pick this to end in a draw? At this, I'm letting Siri decide. Give me a number between one and two. Wait, hold on. Oh, what did I just say? Um... Crap, crap, crap. Okay, I, I, I literally just blanked so hard. Let me say this again. One, I go for Messi. Two, I go for Ronaldo. I don't know if I've accidentally just switched that in my head. One, one Messi, two Ronaldo. Okay, here we go. Siri, so give me a number between one and two. It's one. Okay. One means we are going for Leo Messi. You guys should know my opinion on the Messi versus Ronaldo debate. Dudes, I just love watching them both. I don't have a favorite. I promise you there is literally zero favorite between the two. But for this episode, for the sake of my prediction, I have to go for PSG. Let's get it. And we got freaking Neymar. Absolutely just skilling so hard that he runs out of play. DR7, Rooney, shoot, Rooney, skill, Rooney. I don't know why, bro. I can't get players to shoot in these all-star challenges anymore. They just don't want to shoot the ball. Another chance. Mbappe back. That's a beautiful shot. I was going to say beautiful goal, but it got saved. In the middle. Oh, great header. Was that Messi too? Look at this, man. Boom. Messi. And it's Casillas again. Low-key icon goalkeepers. There might be something about them that gives them a little bit of an extra strength. I don't know what it, what it could be. Neymar, this has to be a goal. This has to be a goal. Casillas. Why isn't he shooting? Why is he not shooting the ball? He had every chance in the world to shoot, and he didn't shoot the ball. Ah, oh, boys, I'm done with this game. It's EA, man. The, the CPU's just sucking this game now. I don't know what it is. Or maybe not. No, they do suck. Last play of the half. Give me, give me something, man. What about that? How about that? Freaking Mbappe. All right, that is something. The celebration. You actually love that, bro. How could you not? How could someone out there not like Mbappe? Right, that's the half. Dudes, I wish... I hate it. I, I want there to be a way for me to be able to make the, the, uh, the teams just shoot more long shots, you know? I want to see more banging goals that we just don't get anymore in this series. Second half, here we go. Can I get a... Oh, yeah. <laughs> or a... Uh... A mihoimini. How about that? I literally might be freaking 90 years old by the time the United gets their first shot in this game. Boys, it's freaking like midnight right now. I'm recording this video. Like, yo, hey, I didn't, I didn't stay up this late to see United and CR7 not take a single shot. Right? We need, we need at least one. Yes. Come on, Di Maria. What do you have? He just. He just stopped. He just literally stopped and let the ball go out. What was that? It's like they're not even trying anymore. What am I witnessing, man? Hey, bro. It's actually like so annoying. Oh, Ronaldo. Yes. Ronaldo. Yes. Oh, my God. Key forward. Complain, 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 complain. Boom. Finally, we get it. Oh, no. Are they going to win it? No. Oh, my God. Pogba might have just saved the day with that block. On the re was gonna score easy right here no doubt about it and then look at this pogba comes in so clutch if united went it right here i'm literally done after having no shots all game if they can get two in the 90th and win it no way right there's no way right there's no way right bro they literally did nothing all game and then this and then two two goal two shots two and they win it i, I actually no it hasn't just happened, has it? No, actually, what it depends. No, 
bro. No. It is my team that loses, bro. Freaking Siri. Why couldn't you have given me CR7? Right. Um, Intellect 2, I guess. Hey, there's still time for PSG. There's still time for the Messi Dream Team. You got career mode simulation. You got the Volt, the tiebreaker if we need it. This is going to be weird, bro. PSG's going to the Prem. Here are the groups. We're making them fair. I've actually moved uh, Man City from PSG's normal group. I think, um, yeah, these are these are pretty pretty even to say the least. Actually, maybe we'll we'll swap Club Bruges with maybe Milan. Yeah, because that gives two four and a half teams. This group has two four and a half teams. Yeah, actually very even. My boys. Oh, I feel like it would be wrong if we didn't see a tiebreaker here. So fully expecting Messi to win this. Yo, hold up. There's there's no way this doesn't go to a Volta match. Out of every all-star challenge that we do, it has to be fair, man. This has to go all three stages. So let's see, though, man. I don't know. The formations, man. I thought that... Hey, let's just see. Wait, hold up. Wait. Hold up. Yo, has this takeover already happened? Why is Newcastle number one in the Prem? Oh, wait, wait. Before we find anything out, what the heck happened have, as the, the takeover might have happened in real life? Let me guess. They signed all. Dude, they literally went on and signed like every free agent. No, bro. That's not fair. That is not fair. Hey, this is what happens when you add every icon in here to the game. Other teams can go on and sign them. Still, though, United did terrible. Dudes, whoa. Okay, this is... Right, this is interesting. So, PSG has topped their group. So, so, whatever team makes it farther wins this leg. Here we go. Both teams are going to make it out, right? I mean, there's no way they don't, right? United. United. United second, though. Okay. Imagine they get matched up here. This is where it could this is where it could get crazy here, boys. All right. This is where it could get crazy. Okay, so PSG is through. So far, so good for them. United is through as well. Oh, quarterfinals. Here we go. PSG is through. United is through. Oh man. This it's been a while since both teams have gone this far. Here we go. Semifinals. Will they get matched up? Finals. They won't, but they're playing in the final. Oh my god, this could not be more perfect. All right. All right, here we go. Here we go. Here we go. For the Volta tiebreaker or PSG. No, or United, excuse me, win the episode. Here we go. Here we go. Moment of truth. It is. It is United, bro. Oh my god. Messi, what have you done? I wanted it to go so bad, bro, to a penalty shootout that I wanted it to go to Volta. We didn't get either. Congrats, United. I, I thought, too, the three at the back would, like, look, look at this, man. I thought the three at the back would treat them poorly, but they freaking killed it. Let me know whose dream teams you guys want to see me build next. We can do it with icons. We can do it again with current players like we did. If there's any rules you guys want me to change, as always, all-star challenges every week. If you guys want to see a random all-star challenge, click right here. Subscribe. Check out the merch. It's all right here. Thank you guys for watching. Yo, um, have a good day, man, and remember to eat your vegetables. I know you don't like them. Put some broccoli every now and then. Yeah. Just eat your vegetables. All right, kids?